Hello, hello, amazing parents of the internet. Ever feel like you're juggling more than a circus performer on a caffeine high? Well, you're not alone. Picture this. You're sipping your coffee or desperately trying to. Backpacks are flying and you're on the first name basis with the snooze button. Welcome to the Parenting Olympics, where the gold medal is just surviving the morning rush. But guess what? Today we're diving into the secrets of parenting for 2024, armed with tips that will not only keep you sane, but also turn your family life into a heartwarming sitcom you've always dreamed of. So, grab your coffee, hit the pause on the morning madness, and let's dive into a world of positive parenting magic. If you're visiting us for the first time, I'm Dr. Tanisha Burke, your positive parenting coach, and welcome to our channel. In the whirlwind of parenthood, it's easy to find ourselves navigating the challenges without a roadmap. However, understanding the potential pitfalls can be the compass that guide us towards a happier family life. By sidestepping these common mistakes, we not only create a nurturing environment for our children, but also lay the groundwork for lasting connections. As we dive into each tip, we'll uncover not just what to avoid, but why it's crucial for the well-being and happiness of both parents and children alike. Let's commit to mindful parenting and embrace the positive changes that will shape our family life in 2024 and beyond. The first parenting mistake we need to avoid is not parenting with kindness, respect and firmness. It is crucial to strike a balance between kindness, respect and firmness in your parenting approach. Being too lenient might lead to a lack of boundaries, while being overly strict can result in feelings of resentment. Aim for a middle ground where you treat your children with kindness and respect, acknowledging their feelings and perspectives while maintaining firm and consistent boundaries. This approach helps cultivate a nurturing environment where your children feel valued and understood, while also learning important life skills and values. Remember parents, a balanced and compassionate parenting style lays the foundation for a healthy parent-child relationship. The second parenting mistake to avoid is overlooking the power of quality time. In our fast-paced world, it's easy to get caught up with the daily hustle and bustle. However, spending quality time with your children is essential for their emotional well-being. Set aside dedicated moments to engage in meaningful conversations, play games, or simply enjoy each other's company. Create memories that will last a lifetime. The third parenting mistake to avoid is neglecting self-care. Parenting is a demanding job and it's easy to forget about your own well-being while focusing on your children. Remember parents, you are the heart of the family and self-care is not a luxury but a necessity. Take breaks, prioritize your mental and physical health and model the importance of self-love for your children. The fourth mistake to avoid is a lack of consistent boundaries. Consistency is the key when it comes to setting boundaries. Children thrive in environment with clear expectations, establish reasonable rules and consequences, and ensure that both parents are on the same page. Consistency fosters a sense of security, helping your children feel confident and loved. The fifth parenting mistake to avoid is ignoring emotional intelligence. In the evolving landscape of parenting, nurturing emotional intelligence is more crucial than ever. Encourage open communication about feelings, validate your children's emotions, and teach them healthy ways to cope with challenges. Building healthy emotional intelligence sets the foundation for strong relationships and resilience in the face of life's ups and downs. This one is a big mistake so many parents make and is to rely solely on technology. While technology can be a valuable tool, excessive screen time can hinder genuine connections. Strive for a healthy balance between screen activities and real life interactions. Engage in offline activities, explore the outdoors and create tech free zones in your home to promote meaningful connections. The seventh parenting mistake that we sometimes make is comparing our family to others. The age-old trap of comparing your family to others has become even more pronounced in the age of social media. So please parents, remember, every family is unique and what works for one may not work for another. Focus on your family's strengths, celebrate individuality and embrace the journey you are in together. 
The eighth parenting mistake is neglecting your child's independence. Allowing your child to explore and develop independence is vital for their growth. While guidance is essential, micromanaging can stifle their creativity and confidence. Encourage them to make age-appropriate choices, learn from mistakes, and take pride in their achievements, which fosters a sense of autonomy. Failure to foster open communication is a mistake we sometimes make without even realizing. So encourage open and honest communication with your children. Create an environment where they feel comfortable expressing their thoughts and concerns. Listen actively without judgment and be genuinely interested in their experiences. Effective communication builds trust and strengthens the parent-child relationship. This is such a big one and it's also that sometimes we ignore or we don't understand the importance of play. Play is a powerful tool for learning and bonding. In the rush of daily responsibilities, it's easy to forget the significance of playtime. Set aside moments for unstructured play where creativity can flourish and laughter can be shared. Play helps children develop social skills, problem solving abilities and provides a platform for joyful connections. And as a final parenting mistake we all need to avoid is underestimating the impact of positive reinforcement. While it's important to address unwanted behavior, parents please don't underestimate the impact of positive reinforcement. Acknowledge and celebrate your child's achievements no matter how small. Positive reinforcement boosts their self-esteem, motivates positive behavior, and strengthens the parent-child bond. Focus on catching them being good and expressing your pride in their efforts. As we get more settled into the new year, let's commit to meaningful parenting and continuous improvement. By avoiding these common pitfalls, we can cultivate a loving and harmonious family environment where both parents and children thrive. Parents, I want you all to remember, there's no one-size-fits-all approach to parenting, but by embracing positive habits, we can create a foundation for a brighter and more fulfilling family life in 2024 and beyond. We hope that you found this video on the common parenting mistakes that we need to avoid informative. If you've watched us and you're not a subscriber, we encourage you to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be alerted of our upcoming videos. And please share this video and our channel with friends and family who you believe may benefit from the content. Thank you so much for supporting us and goodbye for now.